All right, everybody, we're back. And let's set our up. Uh, nope, nope, not yet. We're not gonna. We're not gonna set our theme to that. We're gonna set our theme again to dungeon brick. All right. Um, one of the things we want to do is we want to teleport here. From well, I gotta do something with a a hole in the floor, so I don't want to do with that right now. But let's deal with this. So let me get. Actually, we have enough of them down here. I'm going to take this, extend this all the way up like that. And then we're going to need another one. Um, actually, the other one. Yeah, we're going yeah, we are going to need the other one. Put them right there. Don't overlap them. Just should be fine putting them like that. Maybe bring them out a bit. So this first one, Elijah Connection entered any. I don't know if this is going to work with our custom NPCs. It might. Oh, well, yeah, I'll set the check. No, don't. Uh, uh, I will teleport the player and it'll be triggering player. Then I'm going to take this and move it down here. What? I'm not touching a thing. That was weird. I didn't even set it down. Boy, oh boy. Glitches. And how I'm going to do that. I'm going to get a time delay. What I'm going to do is put that there. Elijah connection entered player. Yeah, I'm going to say player one. Player one's the one that's in control, whatever. And I'm going to say start delay. New logic connection delay completed. I'm going to set that checkpoint. all so if you're playing multiplayer and you do it that way everybody has that checkpoint set all right I'm in there that means all right hold on I haven't checked to see what the sewer looks like in 2d all right not too shabby, not too shabby. Uh, we do need to put a row of something up on top because, well, <laughs> it kinda, that's weird. So I'm gonna go to Simple Toys. Maybe just line it with the... Uh... And then put that on top like that. Or, 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 or save space. And since we use a lot of dusty crop hopper or whatever you're using for the floor, go to terrain. It doesn't matter if it's this or the original texture of it. Because what you're looking for is consistency. That I'm hoping is going to fit the motif. All right, so let me new lodge connection on just so I can teleport here. Yeah, we're good. I don't want to be able to see the sky. That's the thing. Okay. Now, we need... 
change the sky back to something we can work with. I think, wait a minute, why doesn't this, that should have one of those, it doesn't. Well, I'm not going to monkey with the replayers anymore, with this section anyway. Auto start off, and I need to carefully get rid of these trigger areas too. And since I'm not using these anymore, bye, bye, bye. Gone, 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 gone. All right, there's that. I guess you don't need those. I don't know. Yes or no. The next thing we need is to get those, get the stairs and everything in here. So let's start off with the floor. Is that gonna be good enough? I think so. Actually, it's probably too long. So what we're gonna, what I want, is uh, the Dunbrook stairs. And they're gonna be three, because coming down there's three, right? So the middle's gonna be like right there. And that means we're gonna need some replayers and some trigger areas. All right, first things first, get a trigger area. Oh, one right to the left. Right to the left. That kind of weird saying that. Record. That one. That one. That. And that. Clear. Now let's see if I can get three of these together. I don't know if we want, I guess it's fine having the, uh, we want it back or right at the edge. It's not gonna matter, whoops. If we have the bottom of the staircase, like right at the wall, I guess it's gonna be personal preference. Play, play. And then we gotta get wall in here. Now I'm not hooking anything to the wall, so I can, let's see, clear that, clear that. I can just take the wall yeah so if you want to put something on the wall then you're going to want to merge it in like that but well, I'm thinking I don't care what goes that nothing goes on the wall so I'm just gonna butt them up like that so now let's see what happens play play I need to take care of this, this, and the back. Clear, record, I'll just steal one of you. Actually, mm, can I get away with just sticking one of these in there? No, it's gonna hit the, uh, ow. And it's gonna hit the, uh, the floor and then I can't use the straight piece. Uh, let me hit stop. I need one of these, one of these, and a wall. Just make sure it goes, right? So we're not worried about attaching anything to it, even though you can, but it's not going to be worth it, right? Right. Um, oh. On the recorder. Now I can put... Now, I don't think you need to go all the way down, just in the top corner. Should be enough. And then hit play on the stairs. Oh, we got some Z fighting. So we are gonna need to flip that around. 
Well, I don't need that. I don't need that. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take that. I'm just going to flip that around like that. Bring it out. Use a uh, path grader. Properties. Auto start off. New path connection. All right, let's get back in here and see what happens. Good. Probably also would behoove us to make that black. Get rid of these two. Get rid of one of these. Take the other one of those. Put that in here like this. Before I do a new logic connection, I have to have something for it to connect to, and that would be a new uh, a new uh, checkpoint. Properties hidden on new logic connection entered player any teleport player triggering player. All right, I'm gonna take this. And that goes back here and let me turn it around so that'll take us to the top of the stairs let me see what it looks like when I have the camera on All right, save it. So the same thing over here that we just did over there. So three players and trigger areas. Record. Clear. Make that hidden. Uh, terrain. Just like that. Simple toys. Large block wall. Like that. And we're going to put that one in later. Make a new one. Record. Let's get the Dunbrook stairs. One, two. Oh, 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 oh. Stop. We'll have to put these in later. I'm just going to delete that wall. It's in the way again. All right, clear. Now let's bring those walls back in. Path grader. Properties, auto start off, new path connection. That's right, we're gonna make that black, right? And then I need two more of these, one there, one there. Play that back, hit record, grab one of those. One there, one there. Stop. Play the stairs back. All right, clear. 
clear. Play the stairs first. And then, uh, then the uh, pillar blocks. Here we go. Thank you for your patronage. And then you, I will use you for the teleportation. I want to back in far enough where it looks like you're actually doing something. Going somewhere, you know. All right, got one there. And the other one is going to be over here. Oh, I already got it. Oh, I do need another one of these. Properties hidden on. Can I grab this without having any issues and bring that back a little bit? Yeah, I think we got it. All right, so when I enter in this one, new logic connection. Nope, not exited. Cancel. Entered. Player. Player one. Any. Any. Over here. Teleport player. Triggering player. New logic connection. Entered player any teleport player triggering player now this one up here I'll have the uh, checkpoint set when we hit this so I'll take you and do that so I'll just say Elijah connection delay completed Set checkpoint for all. New logic connection entered. Player. Player one. I'll trigger the uh, delay here. Okay, and uh, uh, let me save it before something uh, undesirable happens. <laughs> all right, I'm also going to reload it so I can clean out some of the uh, path creators. All right, let's go find some path creators to eliminate. I think there's only. Aren't there only two? Probably more than that. All right, with those out of the way, let's go into our interior and get some stuff. All right, what kind of stuff do we got? That's a really good question. I don't know of anything that I need to put in here. I was thinking light fixtures, actually, but any of the light fixtures that I need, first of all, um, are going to be in the dungeon that goes down here, but definitely not these candelabras. They, they look cool, but it, it, it would you don't do that. So I guess, uh, and I think with these small ones, though, see, I don't have my favorites on because I went into the interior. I think with those small lamps, I think. I don't need a replayer. I think I can just get away with doing this. Yes, but you can't do that with the with the uh, with the uh, Halloween Town ones. The other thing is, you don't get ambiance from those or illumination. All right, very carefully to grab a hold of that. I don't want every pillar, maybe every other pillar ish. All right. Simple toys, regular vaulted platform, and make sure we have a perpendicular. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. Um, all that. Hoorah that I did about make sure you have the all right. Um, I guess it doesn't matter, huh? Because I forgot about putting the ceiling in. All right, let's see how well this is gonna work with the camera. Is this gonna be good, or do I need to just go through with these with a uh? Uh, a small, uh, the small floor, and just cap that off so I don't see this defighting. Let's let's find out. 
they definitely don't want to cloud the uh, the camera angle with those. We don't want them. We don't want them in our peripheral or our vision or whatever you call it. Oh, time's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of weird having that like that. I'm, I'm not a fan of that. Plus, I can still see the Z fighting. So let's try doing this. Is this going to make everything look bad or better? It's a little bit better. Anyway, that is all the time we have for this episode. Uh, we'll finish this over. We'll continue with this next episode and go down to the... Uh, the secret entrance where uh, in Rondo you get the uh, uh, what's her name Maria so until then remember to keep on building